Uh, federal agencies had pallets of documents sent to Mar-a-Lago one year before that raid. It's all here now. They sent pallets of documents. Do you think somebody went through those document by document? No. Not until the raid because they knew they had salted those documents and they had to put some space and time between them. Couldn't send the documents and go in a week later and say, oh, look, you've got the documents. Too obvious then, right? A federal agency worked with the Trump transition team to send two pallets of document boxes relating to the former president's time in office to his Mar-a-Lago home one year before Jack Smith and his thugs raided the residence looking for classified documents that they had shipped there. Smith indicted Trump, June of 23. The General Services Administration was in talks with Trump's team both during and after his term regarding pallets of items from the president's tenure, according to several emails. The GSA informed Donald Trump's transition team that there were six pallets that needed to be transferred from Virginia to Florida. Six pallets, all right, pay attention. The Federalist.com has this, by the way, and so do some other folks. Of the six pallets, two were designated to be sent to Mar-a-Lago, four to a West Palm storage unit, according to emails. The two pallets to be delivered to Mar-a-Lago from Arlington, Virginia, contained document boxes. Document boxes. I understand that we are ready to ship, read an email sent August 26, 2021, by Kathy Geisler, the director of the Office of Portfolio Management and Real Estate's Program Exec Execution Division that included Trump aide Bo Harrison. I know that originally we had three pallets going to the storage unit. That's now four pallets going to storage. Two pallets will go to Mar-a-Lago. Pallets of documents sent before Jack Smith's raid a year later. How convenient. A July 21 letter from Harrison stated the items to be shipped from Arlington to West Palm were required to wind down the office of the former president or items that are property of the federal government. Well, if they're off property of the federal government, why are you shipping them? It's not clear how long the pallets sat in Virginia or who had access to them or who salted them. An FBI agent said during a witness interview that the GSA was in possession of six pallets, that the office contacted the office of 45 to inform them that, you know, they have to go. According to a screenshot of the transcript posted by independent journalist Julie Kelly. They, someone has to pick them up or they have to be shipped or something to that effect. The National Archives and Records Administration, NARA, at the center of this case, also involved in the transition, but by June of 21, NARA archivist David Friero had become frustrated by the pace of good faith efforts by Trump's team to address NARA's concerns. The Federalist, Federalist asked NARA whether the pallet shipped by GSA included the documents that were later confiscated by Smith's team during their raid of Mar-a-Lago. NARA's media staff responded, that the agency had no awareness about the contents of the materials of the pallets, had no involvement in the move that is referenced in the GSA emails. Ship the pallets of documents, <coughs> excuse me, and then raid his house and say, hey, look, you've got the documents. Huh. 